What's up, YouTube? So, coming at you tonight from Albany, Missouri, where I'm at on my regular job. Uh, well, cleaning sewers. <laughs> Anyhow, so, I just want to discuss with you guys a video that I'm going to try to put together this weekend for you on um, one of the lake on the primary lake that I fish at, uh, which is uh, Lake Lu Ye Lake Yeager in Litchfield, Illinois. It's a great little lake. It's about eh, four miles long, eh, about maybe a mile, about maybe a mile wide. I go out there and have a good time. Now, I do want to first say I am not professional by any means necessary. I do not do. I do not fish for a living. Um, I do not fish for any kind of source of income. I fish for the fun of it. Now, don't get me wrong. Eventually, I do want to be able to go into the um, tournament leagues and be able to start fishing some different tournaments and everything. But for me, it's been quite a while since I've done any kind of fishing, so... I'm just trying to get back into the hang of things. Not doing too bad, if I do say so myself. Um, anyhow, if anybody saw the first video that I posted down here, which was the introductory video, and I think I uploaded a second video after that. I'm not 100% sure. Don't quote me on that. Um, I can't remember if it actually uploaded or not. I've been having problems because signal in my area sucks, and the area that I'm in right now sucks. And... Well, as we can, as you can probably tell, I'm actually using my phone to record these videos. Now, the video that I'm going to try to put together this weekend, um, unfortunately, I can't make any promises that I'll be able to get out there because um, I'm having some problems with the cameras that I bought. Um, I don't have the uh, GoPro camera. Um, I have a Viv. Viv Vivitar or whatever it's called. I got from Walmart. Got uh, a couple of them from Walmart for uh, $40. So we'll see how it works out with those. Hopefully they do good. And I got to figure out where I'm going to mount one of them at on my boat. So that's a big thing right there. Anyhow. Um, so there's different brands of lures that I use for bass fishing. Uh, mostly for the soft plastics, I use Zoom. No, I am not sponsored by Zoom. Um, it's just what I use and what works. Um, I also use uh, Rapala. Um, and uh, da, 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 I got a new one. I'm trying to remember the name of it, but it's a, a company that I've never heard of before. So... Um, I can't, can't really exactly tell you what the, uh, what the name of the company is because it's just one that I've never actually heard of before. Um, I haven't gotten a chance to use it yet. I have heard good things about the, uh, um, about the lures. So hopefully, you know, everything will, hopefully everything will work out and it'll be a good lure. We'll see. Um, with it now, with it, uh, getting into, um, you know, summertime now, higher temperatures, so on and so forth, you know, the fish are going to be acting a little bit differently, um, in the water than they, than what they would be during the springtime and such. Um, they got, um, you know, in the mornings they're up in the, uh, shallow areas you know, do, getting their food, so on and so forth. And then once it starts getting hot outside, you know, they swim out to the deeper water and they get in some brush and stuff like and stuff like that. Um, so obviously the fishing techniques during the summertime is a little bit different. Now, um, I have, I also have two different style um, poles that I use. I use a Luz and the um, Abu Garcia. Um, that's also what I use for the reels as well. Um, the Abu Garcias, I use those for my bait casters. Uh, the Lou's, I use those for the spinners. 
and then I got another cheap one that I bought uh, just have as a little backup um, I can't even remember who makes that one it was $15 reel at uh, uh, local farm store so yeah it actually works pretty good but anyhow um, so this is Wednesday night and I'm sitting on the sink <laughs> But anyhow, this is Wednesday night. Um, hopefully, I'm going to tomorrow, because uh, I'm actually going to be heading home here shortly, uh, within the next hour. I'll be heading on my way home, and it's a six-hour drive. So, we'll see. Uh, obviously, when I get home, I'm going to be doing some sleeping, but... Uh, tomorrow when I wake up, I'm going to mess around with the camera a little bit. I'm going to see if I can get the camera mounted on the boat. Um, and then the other camera, um, I got to figure out how, what to do with that one too. So anyhow, so I just wanted to, uh, do a quick little check in here, uh, with everybody. Um, I'm going to try to do, uh, I'm going to try to do, uh, some YouTube videos every weekend. Um, hopefully that works out, but a lot of that too does depend upon my schedule and everything. So, anyhow, so uh, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, end the video right here, everyone. And uh, everyone out there, uh, please be safe. And we will catch you on the flip side.